welcome to another video. Today we're diving into the vibrant and flavorsome world of Tunisian cuisine and I'm thrilled to guide you through the preparation of a special dish, Tunisian octopus couscous. So let's get started. First, we're gonna need one onion that we cut on half and dice into small cubes. Then, we need five garlic cloves that we peel and chop finely. Next, we need three carrots that we're gonna cut in half and put aside. Last but not least, we'll take two tomatoes, cut them into quarter and blend them perfectly until we get a smooth texture. Now prepare the octopus, rinse it well under cold water. In a large pot put the octopus and add hot water. Bring the water to a boil, simmer gently for about one hour or until the octopus is tender. Heat some olive oil in a steamer pot on a medium heat, add the hot peppers until golden brown. In the same pot, put the onions and the garlic cloves and stir for about 4 to 7 minutes until slightly softened. Now, add one and a half cup of tomato puree and the tomatoes blended previously. For the spices, we're gonna need 1 tablespoon ground caraway, 1 tablespoon ground coriander, 1 tablespoon ground cayenne red pepper, half teaspoon black pepper, 1 teaspoon of harissa and some salt to taste. Stir everything together and add the octopus with its boiling water. Next, we prepare our couscous by adding the essential spices needed for this dish. Some olive oil, half teaspoon salt, one tablespoon turmeric and four cloves. Add the carrots and 100 grams of cooked chickpeas in the pot. Put the couscous with the mixed spices in the steamer for about 20 minutes. After 20 minutes, in a large plate, put the couscous, add some hot water and mix well. Add a bit of dried rose petals and bring it back to the steamer for another 8 minutes. Finally, add the couscous with the remaining sauce and mix it well until we get a nice color. We decorate our plate with the octopus, the carrots, chickpeas and the cooked hot peppers. Enjoy your meal. Sahawafel Jamia.